Hey, it's Sharon, your guitar guide, helping you find your sound today. I've got an acoustic blues guitar lesson, and it's how to play the blues scale. And that's coming up. Hey, thanks for stopping by the channel, and if this is your first time here, I'd like to welcome you and ask you to have a look around the channel. If you like what you see, go ahead and subscribe for more guitar tips, and don't forget to click the bell icon so you could be notified every time I upload a video. Today I wanted to show you how to play the blues scale, and I wanted to start in the key of G, which is right here on your third fret. So first, let's look at the pentatonic scale. Maybe you know this, or maybe you don't. But here it is, right here. Okay, we're going to start on the G. Third fret. Sixth string. Sixth fret, sixth string. On the fifth string, third fret. Fifth fret. Fourth string, third fret. Fifth fret. Third fret. Fifth fret on the G string, third fret, sixth fret on the B string, third fret, sixth fret on the high E. And you're probably thinking, well, what does the pentatonic scale have to do with the blues scale? I came here to learn the blues scale, so. gonna get to it. So the pentatonic scale is five notes, which I just showed you what they are. They just repeat. So to play the blues scale, we just add a note. It's called the blue note. So we've still got the three, six, C sharp is one of the notes. Three, five, three, five, six, which is the C sharp. So the two, that's a blue blues note. Hey, go over to yourguitarguide.com and get the free PDF with the blue scales on it. It'll help you out. So practice that. So once you've memorized that scale there, you can play lots of solos. The cool thing about knowing the blue scale just move it up the guitar neck like say you're gonna play in the key of A Five eight five eight, and then when you come back up, you're eight five. So to practice this, you can if you have a looper pedal, you can play the rhythm and then practice going up and down the blues scale with it, like this. Improvise. So 
if you've learned anything from this video, can you give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment? Don't forget to check that video out there. Thanks.